me? I will trade you for anything. Home village. Home. Huh? Yeah. No sign of Mongols. As soon as I could. It's good to see you, Yuriko. You look tired. Are you hungry? Not now. Thank you. The Khan's army must have marched past here. Have you had any trouble? A few bandits. Nothing I can't take care of. I've come for my father's... my armor. You refused to wear it at Komoda Beach. A lot has changed since then. I hid it somewhere safe. Come this way. These old bones. I'll get Taichi to help me fetch it. He's at the cemetery. What's he doing there? Tending the grounds. Gathering plants for my poisons. Keeps vermin out of our food stores. I'm glad you're not alone. What about Lord Shimura? Alive. The Mongols captured him at Komoda. But we freed him. Oh. Others survived. And they're helping you? A few. Lady Musical. Good. She's been fighting alongside the boys since she was knee-high. <laughs> You'll have to tell me more about that someday. But it's just the two of you? A few others. Sensei Ishikawa. I haven't seen him in years. Does he still act like he's the only one who knows how to do things? Half the time he's right. But his aim is unmatched. He would certainly agree. Lord Sakai, you're back! I wish I could stay. 
But I hear you're taking good care of Yuriko. You've got that backwards, my lord. Daichi, help me get the Sakai armor. Go. I should pay my respects. His grave close, his soul distant. All things pass away. Lightheaded. For a moment, I thought you looked. Face us, coward! Get inside.
Yuriko. Lord Sakai. Are you all right? You butchered them. Is Yarikawa giving us trouble again? The Yarikawa rebellion was 20 years ago. Those men were with the Mongols. Of course. Seeing you like that, I'm still shaken up. I need to catch my breath. By the lake. Your favorite tree. Yes. Come. You said earlier you've been making poisons. Keeps the vermin out of our rice. Can you make it stronger? Enough to kill a man? No one deserves that. Can you do it? The effects in larger doses are ugly. Good. Oh, my lord. <sighs> Sit with me a moment. Poison has never been the Sakai way. No Sakai had to fight the Mongol Empire. I need every weapon we have. Tsushima can't afford anything less. The Mongols have changed you, young master. The world has changed. My mother taught me about plants that heal, others that harm, even kill. But they must be consumed. How will you poison the invaders? A blowgun and darts. I've read of their use by a Genji warrior who studied with monks from the West. Will you help me? Promise me you'll remain the good man I know. I promise. I've looked after your every need since your mother carried you. I won't stop now. All I need is something to make a blowgun. Mm, used to be a lot of reeds on the other side of the lake, where the old fishermen lived. Remember? You and your little friend gathered them to make little boats. Ryuzo and I, we spent all day reenacting the Battle of Danora. Be careful, Jin. I've seen fires over there at night. Not sure who it is. Don't worry, I'll be back soon with reeds. Go get your reeds. Yuriko was right. The old fisherman's home has been taken over by bandits. Face me!
Perfect for a blowgun. I'll get these to Yuriko. Excuse me, young master. You caught me thinking about Lord Sakai. I try not to do that. He loved you in his way. Enough of the past. We have a blowgun and darts. All I need now is the poison. Of course, young master. Come with me. Here, I have a small camp where I gather plants and herbs for ointments. And poison. It kills vermin within moments. Make it strong enough for the invaders. Nice to ride with you again. You and Lord Shimura taught me to ride. <laughs> On that runt pony. <laughs> you sat so tall and straight in your little saddle. Like you were the Shogun himself. No, little Jin. What's so funny? I just remembered it was out here you nearly killed your uncle. What? You were three or four. The poor man was trying to teach you how to hold your wooden kodachi. You wanted to chase butterflies. I know the story. My uncle's black eye took weeks to heal. <laughs> Lord Shimura and your father laughed so hard, I fear they both choked to death. I don't remember my father's laugh. He lost his humor after your mother got sick. But you have your father's laugh. Here we are. A gozomat and a campfire. You sleep out here? <laughs> Only when I spend the day foraging for plants. I'll look for the flowers we need. Rest, Yuriko. I will get them for you. Don't eat the seeds, they're poisonous. I'm not a child, Yuriko. Oh, <laughs> I know. Remember how we gather flowers for your mother? She arranged them for the little alcove at home. That should be enough. Bring them to me, young master. Your plants. Good. We extract the seeds, crush them, make a paste, and dip the needles. Make sure the dose is strong. It should do what you need.
It's done. You're sure he came this way? The old woman has a camp around here somewhere. Listen. Someone's coming. Stay there, Yuriko. Let's see if this poison works. He will regret what he did to Sadamune and the others. I just want his head. And the price that goes with it. How much farther? It's around here somewhere. Let me get my bearings. Hurry up. I don't want to lose him. Are you hurt, young master? Don't worry. I dealt with them. <sighs> sometimes I forget you're a grown man. I forget sometimes, too. We should get back to the estate. I'll stay. I need to straighten the place up. Don't push yourself too hard. Hush! You are not a child, and I'm old enough to take care of myself. What other kinds of poison can you make? Always so impatient. There is another. It causes confusion and rage. But the ingredients... What were they? Try to remember. It sounds useful. you were here. Young master, would you like something to eat? I'm fine, Yuriko. I just need the poison. You are trying to remember the ingredients. They were flowers. You remember them, don't you? The ones I planted at your family cemetery. I remember washing the graves. Father made me hold buckets of water from the lake. He knew it would make you strong and teach you to respect your ancestors. Don't you remember the flowers, Jin? Spider lilies. That's right. You can craft a poison that makes rats go mad. Tear each other to pieces. It's awful. It's for a good cause. Just make it strong enough to work on men. <sighs> if you think it's necessary, I know exactly where to find what we need. This way. This part of the forest. I was here when I was a child. After your mother passed away. I refused to believe she was gone. So I ran from home and came here. Your mother loved to take long walks here. I searched until sundown. I kept shouting for her. But she was gone. And I was lost. You were missing for three days. Nearly dead by the time your father found you. I've never seen him so angry. Angry at himself for failing to protect you. I've seen your father before countless battles. And he was never more worried than the sleepless nights he spent searching for his only son. Not much farther to the cemetery. I wonder what your father would make of the ghost. He would disapprove, like my uncle. Don't be so sure. They argued often. Kazumasa thought your uncle too rigid. 
Willfully blind to possibilities. Kazumasa had imagination. Imagination? My father? You're like him in more ways than you know. Careful. Disrespecting the dead. Stay here. Throw your blades! Kyrgyagorpe! Ukurtan Tornegoti! Kholokchin Akpulna! I'm right here! It's safe to look for the spider lilies. Why would we look for them here? Isn't this where you used to plant them? Oh. Uh, no, not here. It's been so long. They're in another cemetery. Your great aunt's branch of the family. It's not far. Yuriko, do you remember... I was five or six. I had a nightmare about this forest. A fight. 
It wasn't a nightmare. I told you it was to keep you calm. That was real? I remember men shouting. Our retinue was returning home late one night. We were ambushed by Ronin. The Ronin must have been dangerous. My father's samurai were frightened. Not of the Ronin. Of Kazumasa. Of my father? Why? He and his samurai drove the Ronin off. But Kazumasa pursued them on foot. You could hear their screams. He returned to us just before dawn, covered in blood. Some of his own men mistook him for a demon of the forest. Do you recognize this lake? We used to meditate here. <laughs> How you'd fidget. You told me to pretend I was a rock, and all I wanted was to swim. <sighs> the view's much better from the shore. Join me, young master. These old bones need a rest. <laughs> This time, you'll have to keep me from fidgeting. <laughs> Some of my favorite memories happened at this lake. Stopping a child's fidgeting? Your mother and I would come here when she was pregnant with you. We should keep moving. <laughs> A grown man, and you still can barely sit still. We can meditate again, after the war. Yes, young master. Cemetery isn't far. Feels much closer when you're not carrying water. They may break stone, but they cannot erase the memory of these warriors. Please gather the spider leaves. I can't bear to look. Matsu would weep at the condition of this place. Most of these warriors fell in the rebellion at Yariko. They deserve better than this. <laughs> this is all I could find. It is enough to make the poison, but... I don't want our time to end. The Shimura Cemetery isn't far. With a view of the waterfall. Let's go, my lord. Enjoy our rides together. Did you say Kazumasa? Oh, did I? You ride with your father's grace. Did you often go riding with my father? Lord Sakai taught me to ride a horse. Careful, Mongols ahead. Wait, I can mix the new poison for you.
How does it work? Oh, it's terrible. Causes madness. They'll turn on each other like wild beasts. Good. Make it. Quickly. The poison is finished. Take it. I'll stay here. are gone. I won't need it. But we rid ourselves of those bandits. Not bandits, Mongols. Oh, I couldn't see them from here. After all this, I'm worried about the Shimura Cemetery, my lord. Would you check on it with me? Of course, Yuriko. Let's have a look.
Are you tired, Yudiko? No, Lord Saka. This is the best day I've had since our afternoon at Lake Umi. I don't remember that. You are sure that was me? Uh, it, it was so long ago. You must have forgotten. hasn't touched this place. Do you remember, young master? We pay our respects to the Shimura warriors there. I remember, Giriko. Let's write one now. Stone abides rushing water. Life blossoms and fades. Well said, my lord. The proud do not endure. The greatest of us fall in the end. We should return to Omi. I'll stay a while. I know better than to argue. Good. You learned something today. Kazumasa used to say Lord Shimura was too concerned with that castle. The strongest point on the island. He equated strength with the, the huge, the immovable. Like a mountain. Yet a point. Doubt and indecision have destroyed armies. In the midst of battle, true leaders must stay rooted, stand firm. But look at that waterfall. All that immovable rock yields to water. The strength we need is all around us. I have one more place I would like to visit, my lord. When you're ready.
Lord Sakai. <coughs> Excuse me. The cold wind is getting to me. Yuriko, you're not well. What nonsense. Let me take you to Akashima. They can treat you. We have to visit someplace special. Where? It's not far. After that, I promise we will see your healers. Fine. But if you start feeling worse, we go straight to Akashima. Of course, my lord. Always so stern. Where is this special place of yours? You'll see. You cannot tell me? I won't have to. Lead the way. Let's see if you can keep up. Careful, Yuriko. There's an onsen around here, isn't there? There it is. Shall we take a closer look? <sighs> isn't it? Beautiful. Very. Why are we here? Are you upset? I hope it's not wrong of us to come. I don't understand. Oh, it's so painful to see you weighed down by sadness with Lady Sakai and the little one. Yuriko, are you all right? It's nothing. I just felt a little faint. When did you last eat? Yesterday, I think. Wait here. I'll find us something. I'm not a child. Please, Yuriko. Rest here a moment. As you wish. Since you ask so sweetly. I'll be back soon. Maybe there's game nearby. Bring this to Yuriko. 
Make her eat a little. Uh. Let's go! Horse isn't here. She rode off. She can't be far. You do not. Please. For all the times I've done as you asked. Come with me. Let me pay respects to my mother. All right. But don't push yourself. Thank you. My mother would take me on long walks in these hills and teach me about the plants. Maybe that's why you saw her. little chin to me and he was so sick after all that time in the forest we had already lost lady sakai kasumasa are you listening i'm listening I made him drink that remedy my mother taught him. We sat by his side the whole night. 
You held my hand. Do you remember? Yes, I remember. That night, I was so scared. So sad for little Jin. But I was so happy. Does that make me a bad person? No. When he recovered, when you taught me how to ride, the day we rode to the onset, oh, the sunset was red and full. That was... That was what? see all the way to Yariko. I remember the war. A tragedy for all the clans. Castle Canada. I wish you weren't there so often. Why do you say that? You have many responsibilities. I am grateful for the time we share. But I always want more. There's the temple in Kushi. You can see the pagoda. Every new year, I pray there for you and little Jin and my family. Jin is lucky you take such good care of him. Now tell me what you see. Yuriko? Rest, Yuriko. The strength we need is all around us. The mighty fall at last to be no more than dust before the wind. That's my cousin. Halt, Ronin. State your business. I'm not a Ronin. My name is Jin Sakai. A samurai? Lady Sanjo will want to see you. She's in charge of Omugi Cove. Please, come with me. This way, my lord. It's important you speak to the lady.
This is an interesting find, very recent. I'll see you again. I hope the roads remain clear for you, my lord. Lord Sakai, this is Lady Sanjo. Welcome to Umugi Ko. I see the Mongols haven't found this place. Thankfully, no. There hasn't been bloodshed here for many years. Anyone who draws a weapon answers to my men. Your safety is assured, so long as you abide by that same rule. Now please, tell me how I may help you. I'm looking for a smuggler named Goro. <laughs> Interesting. He is downstairs, having his third bottle of sake. Enjoy your visit with him. Thank you. Come see me again sometime. I think we can help each other. Lord Samurai, please, I have a message for you. What's wrong? A demon is going to kill me if I don't tell you his tale. Don't waste my time. Demons are just legends. Not this one. His name is Kojiro, and he cannot die. You must be Goro. Uh, we must all be someone. Who must you be? Lord Sakai. Ah, the samurai are all dead. I'm very much alive. But my patience is dying. Lord Shimura asks that you repay your debt to him. He's alive? What does he want? To deliver a message to the mainland. Uh, I charged a lot for that trip. Even before the Mongol blockade. You owe my master a debt. This will repay it. Then I have no choice. After Komoda Beach, I thought my debt to Lord Shimura was erased. That's why I was drinking. To celebrate your escape? To mourn the samurai. Those warriors died protecting men like me. Hmm? They swore to defend everyone on Tsushima. Even you, Goro. I don't know if I can repay their sacrifice. My master wouldn't ask for your help if he expected you to fail. Hmm. This is my home. Come in. Hmm. Getting past that Mongol blockade won't be easy. 
Do you have Lord Shimura's message? He has it. At his camp on the Akashima coast. Ah. I can work with that. One of my boats is hidden near Fort Mitodake. This map shows where I'll wait on the forest road. Open up, Goro! We're not leaving until you pay us what you owe! Shit! I'll deal with them. Get moving. And I'll leave you to it. See you in Akishima, Lord Sakai. There's no use hiding, Koro. I didn't call for Ronin. Uh, my lord, what's your business with Goro? Private. We'll... we'll be back. I was trying to fix my wagon with pieces from a bamboo stand when I was told a samurai had built it. Is that true, my lord? We use the bamboo to hone our skill with the sword. It takes focused blade to cut through all of the bamboo in one stroke. Please forgive my ignorance. I put everything back where it belonged, even the flag beside it. I appreciate that, but it would have been all right to repair your wagon. I'll make sure the stand sees use. That remains to be seen. What's wrong, Kenji? Uh, I owe money to a bandit, um, Gon the Butcher. Then you should pay him. I will. I will. But uh, he wants to meet me in the middle of nowhere so he can cut my throat. What did you do to deserve that? He paid for a delivery of sake and medicine, and I might have skimmed some to help survivors fleeing Izuhara, and they didn't think he'd notice. <laughs> there are better ways to help people, Kenji. My lord, I'm an idiot. And you want me to clean up your mess? Couldn't you just watch from the shadows in case Gon tries anything? If you scare him off, he'll just put a price on my head. Your intentions this time were... better than usual. I will help. Thank you, my lord. Where's the money? Where's the money to pay your bandit friend? I brought it. Don't worry. Um, gone since the meeting. Lead the way. Every time I get in a mess like this, I'm as scared as the time before. You want to help your nerves? Stop stealing from killers. But the first time Gon caught me, he wasn't even angry. How many times have you cheated him? Three. You should stick to selling sucker. Even that can be dangerous. 
The first batch I sold, I borrowed from a monastery. You stole from monks. I figured if I got caught, they'd go easy on me. Interesting strategy. You'd think. Turns out they were warrior monks. <laughs> Swords and spears of Buddha, right? <laughs> I think they're still hunting me. You're a busy man. I know, my lord. Trouble follows me everywhere. You follow trouble, Kenji. You should ask yourself why. The meeting is on that bridge. Let's stop here. Go to the bridge. I'll find a spot with a clear view of Gong. All right. And if anything goes wrong, I'll signal you. I'll shout, I'm so happy to see you. As you wish. Set up. Have to protect Kenji. He'll see me if I go this way. All right. Go on. Kenji's in danger. My life, Lord Sakai. You owe me more than that. Whatever you want. A sake, a saddle polish, a nice... Kenji, why risk your life over trifles? Not trifles. I need food, money, a warm fire. You helped me save Taka. Delivered medicine to people in need. Yeah. <laughs> that was heroic, wasn't it? You have a talent, Kenji. It's time you use it, for the sake of our island. Of course. 
Honor is my specialty. Ryuzo said you're the greatest swordsman he ever met. I had to see for myself. You'd be better off taking his word for it. I've trained with the blade since I could walk. There's no one left to challenge me but you. Justice! They never did.
You fought well, but we're finished. Sakai, you are destined to wear that armor in battle. I hope I'm worthy of it. I found Goro in Umugi Cove. Was he drunk? Not anymore. He will fulfill his debt to you and sail for the mainland. He may be unsavory, but few know the sea like Goro. Will these men deliver your message? Precisely. Kotaro and Jiro are loyal and courageous. I will petition the Shogun for reinforcements. Goro is ready. He will meet us nearby, then lead us to his boat. We will ride when the time is right. Take this moment to prepare for battle. Yes, Uncle. It is time. To your horses, men. We are ready, my lord. Stay alert. And keep watch for our smuggler. Good horse. Here! I can always tell when you want to ask me something. Out with it. I'm curious how you met Goro. I caught him selling Chinese silk forbidden by Shogun decree. I burned his stock. I let him go. He could have been flogged, but you saw a better path. A skilled sailor can be a valuable asset. The Mongols have many ships. Can Goro evade them all? He has no choice. What will we do if they catch us, my lord? Do not fear death, Kotaro. Live with courage, and never forget the people you fight to protect. Lord Shimura! Goro! Where is your boat? This way. I'm happy you're alive, my lord. Thank you for agreeing to settle your debt. I'll do my best. But I fear the Mongols will sink me before I leave the coastline. There are too many eyes watching the water. Perhaps we can direct their attention elsewhere. Dismount. We walk from here. Fort Mitodake. My father took that stronghold from Clan Yarikawa. Now the Mongols have it. Imagine their surprise when two samurai take it back from them. If we make enough noise inside the fort... Mm. The Mongol ship crews will look to it instead of the water. Goro, we will draw the enemy's attention to the fort. Sail when you hear the fighting. My lord, you will be killed! Your only concern is delivering my message. Horses might give us away. We will go on foot, Lord Sakai. Mongol armies are formidable, but our attack will catch them off guard. Let's pray that holds true in the fort. They outnumber us, but they cannot attack all at once. How long can we keep the element of surprise? Only until we see the enemy. Then, 
We strike. Mongols in. We could avoid them. Turn your back on a foe, and you will die with a sword stuck in it. To fight beside you, Jean. See how the enemy fear you. You are a true warrior. Thank you, Uncle. Remain alert. Huh? Watch us. Take cover. We have to get through that gate. Lord Sakai, with me. Wreak havoc on the fort! We need the Mongol ships to focus here, not on Goro! Osho! Ships to get built!
power chip. Cut them down. But in time, but not enough. The Mongols have seen them, and their attack ships are faster. Our men are defenseless. No, they have us. We have a Huacha. A weapon of the enemy, not samurai. Saving our people is all that matters. You know how to fire this. I'll learn. Destroy the Mongol ships. Leave the guards to me. Uncle. We will not die here, my boy. The Mongols sent boarding parties. Don't let their boats reach Goro. It's working. The Mongol ships are in flames. Close that up. Goro must not run them.
on the shore. Slow down, Goro. Ships on the way. Hold on, Goro. You made it, Goro. Bring us the Shogun's help. We did it. I knew we would. You continue to prove the Mongols are not unstoppable. You taught me to fight. I couldn't disappoint you. And you never have. I am proud of the warrior. The man you have become. Jin, my message to the Shogun included an announcement. I wish to formally adopt you as my son. Uncle. In my heart, you have always been the heir to my legacy. When this war ends, we will make it official. One day, our people will look to you as their leader. You will become their honorable Jito, backed by all the power of the Shogun. I hope I can serve them as well as you have. I know you will. We must finish our preparations while we wait for the Shogun's reinforcements. What are your orders? We need to bolster my army. Help your friend recruit the people of Yarikawa to our cause. I'll meet Yuna soon. When you're ready, meet me at our staging camp in Kubala. Then we will retake my castle from Kotun Khan. And save our home. As father and son. The Shogun himself will celebrate our victory. We will meet again soon. Until then, travel safely. Uh.